In spring, these islands here at Castle Espy were absolutely dominated by a colony of black-headed gulls and also terns that were nesting here. But in autumn, it's a whole different matter. The gulls have gone, the terns have gone, the noise is gone. But there are some more subtle sounds to be discovered. The breeze sings through the reeds, the perfect pitch to sit and listen to some of the species that call Castle Espy home. I'm still a little bit of a tropical person at heart, so saying goodbye to summer can be really hard. But autumn is a chance to slow down and enjoy just those simple pleasures. The call of the UK's fastest and heaviest duck resonates around the reserve. Wings beat in the air as waterfowl dive and splash below. Oyster catches can be heard across the mudflats as they search for sustenance. They are joined by migrants making their way here from far off shores. Light-bellied Brent geese hustle and bustle. And the first hooper swans from Iceland announce their arrival with their iconic sound as they fly overhead. It's a quieter, more reflective time, but there is still as much life out there if you look closely. Now, this isn't the only place where migrant birds arrive in the UK. There are other places to spot these birds as they journey over here. And boats and ships out at sea might be a surprising spot, but Alistair Taylor, who is currently, as we speak, out at sea on a support vessel somewhere in the North Sea, has been enjoying a spot of bird watching in between shifts. Now, if that sounds like a surprising place to spot things, take a look at the sort of things he's seeing. This is brambling, just perched there on some wire on the decking. Now, these are birds that breed in Scandinavia and Russia, but they head over in their millions at this time of year. Obviously, they're trying to escape those really harsh winters over there. Now, the next bird he sees is a starling. Now, this is a European bird, one of millions that'll be making its way across to join resident birds. Now, this is a species on decline, but historically, up to 87,000 birds were counted in a single day passing overhead. And then this was sent in by Alistair just today. This is a pink-footed goose just hanging out on the deck there. 